Hello, hello, awesome people. Welcome to this Deadman Mode movie. This is going to be movie consisting from day one to day seven of my Deadman Mode tournament number 13. And obviously Deadman Mode tournament number 14 comes out in two days. So I want to have this video out here so I can watch it. I can maybe change some strategies or just to show you guys my strategy, what I do to have one of the best accounts in the Dead Metal Tournament in as short time span as possible. And uh, I really hope you guys will enjoy this video. It takes a little bit of time to render and upload because it's a very long one. Um, but with all means, just enjoy it, escape on the side, grab a popcorn and have fun. And I'll see you soon with uh, Dead Metal Mode Tournament number 14, which will also be the last Dead Metal Mode Tournament for a while. So with that out of the way, enjoy the video. That's where experience really comes into this. I've seen, I've seen Mika being very consistent with his switches and taking the kill there. Right take it home. Okay, be quick, be quick. I need to be a bit more fashionable. Look at me. Boom, accept. Skippy? Come on, come on, come on. Uh, send me to mainland. And we are in. Let's go. Okay, quickly. Set this up like that. Uh, I'm gonna have to set F keys quickly, but firstly, we're gonna go to the bank, throw shit in that I won't need. Alright, let's talk about the plan while we have some time. Firstly, 10,000 coins from the Stronghold of Security should be very easy to achieve, uh, and that's what we're going for right now. So, we're gonna get 2k here, 3k in the next room, and then 10k in the end, and then we're gonna start training our stats already uh, in Lumbridge by taking the starter pack so let's just get ourselves 10k and hopefully not die in the process 10k let's teleport to lumbridge we are gonna do a couple of things here first thing we're gonna talk to ranged combat instructor ask for starter pack get the starter pack talk to her again talk about something else um toggle my ammo equip automatically equip it we're gonna talk to magic training uh, not the starter pack something else um toggle my runes equip automatically send to rune pouch there we go really important boom starter pack unlocked i can now drop bronze sword beautiful let's get training real quick we're gonna start off um with obviously attack strength defense and uh it's gonna be great until 30 then we go to varrock all right let's make a quick update for the youtube um so currently those are my stats i stopped at 51 strength and now i'm going straight to 60 attack then hopefully i'll have a dragon scimitar by then and then we're gonna finish 65 attack and strength and then we're gonna move our way to grind defenders i'm only gonna do like one update in the meantime i got myself mithril plate body and adamant sword with a 10k uh, that we got from the start and that's just about it i've been killing frogs and burying the bones the plan is also to get 43 prayer just burying the normal bones before we get to the guild if i get the stats beforehand though we're, we're just gonna go straight to the guild um and it should be pretty much very very simple so i'll talk to you guys when i get 65 65 all right so here is the plan we now have 60 attack 51 strength and we also have the emblems needed for the dragon scimitar so we're quickly gonna get 25 agility just because it's very helpful and i will eventually get 71 anyways uh, so i need 25 for the agility shortcut over the Actually, no, I only need 21, I think, for the Grand Exchange shortcut. So, so that's what we're getting here in a couple of minutes. And then we buy the Dragon Scimitar. We continue training until 65, 65. And then we find our way to Falador and start getting for those defenders. So I'll be a little bit later to other people. But I already have my magic to where I want it to be for the teleports. I already have... Uh, I'll have my agility up and it's all, all in all gonna be worth it. So let's get this 21 very quickly and then continue with the training. Here we go. This agility shortcut gives me 21 agility, hopefully. Yep, there it is. And with that, well, it didn't show, but if we look at agility shortcuts, 21 right here, Grand Exchange Agility Shortcut, which is what we need right now. Uh, let's get Dragon Scimitar. Here we go, three emblems going in and buying a Dragon Scimitar. Beautiful. Let's go back to Lumbridge, finish 65-65. And uh, then it's time to go and, uh, well, get defenders. So, really good so far. Happy with how things are going. I just reached a very important level. Unfortunately, it doesn't pop up on the screen until you're over level 50. But now we can pray protect from melee, which is huge in Deadman mode, especially. 
So uh, we're now very safe when we get into the guild. Still no 65 attack and strength though, but we're slowly getting there. And there's 65 strength as well, just more 5 attack levels. And we are off to grind for the defenders, which should take quite so many hours, but uh, let's get the 65 attack first. Almost done. Almost done. Let's go one more hit, and there it is. Beautiful. No wasting time, we're gonna now start training defense, obviously to 60 for the defenders, but we're gonna do it all in the guild. Uh, but first I need to get my get myself some potions, some strength potions, attack potions, prayer potions, stuff like that. And then we go and uh, hopefully get luck in the guild. And here we go, the tournament begins here. This is where I actually start enjoying it. Look at this guy, he got fed as fuck. It's crazy. Alright, here the fun begins, let's go. Let's have some fun. And I, if I don't perfectly flick, I want to at least sometimes... There it is, there it is, beautiful. First defender took me 18 minutes, 16 seconds to get. And we can now get rid of the wooden shield. Beautiful. Let's keep going. Lucky. This is the one place where I want to get lucky. I was giga lucky. <gasps> back to back. Iron defender. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yes, yes, yes. I was just talking about the luck, dude. I was just talking about luck, boys. It's happening. It is happening. Three, let's go. We're happy. We are happy. Finally. Oh my god. This one, ladies and gentlemen. Holy, I can't even say ladies and gentlemen. This one took me one hour and 20 minutes to get. We now should be on Mithril Defender if we were on the drop rate. Because we have 103 KC. Which is not the case yet, but hopefully the luck changes around a little bit. We get a little bit more lucky. And let's see how it goes. That's really good though, we break the dry streak. There we go, finally, for fuck's sake. Two hours. Two hours, no joke, for that one. Lul. That one, yikes. That one took too long, man. Okay, so, I haven't updated the stats in a while. Those are the stats, 65 attack, 75 strength. 60 defense and 49 prayer already, which is quite okay, quite nice. Um, the plan is basically to have 85 combat before I get out of this place, so I can go straight to Neve, which will definitely happen at this pace. So it, it is pretty good. Uh, we're just gonna go hard on strength, and then if we get a task that requires me... Well, if we get a task with a monster that has high defense, I'll then get more attack levels to make it a bit easier on myself, but... So far, so good, I guess. Let's just hopefully get a little bit more lucky. Please? Fuck. <gasps> yes, finally! Woohoo! Mithril, nice. Okay, okay, that took 10 minutes. Not gonna complain. We're smurfing. Let's go, just adamant and rune to go. I need to get more tokens, though. Uh, we are 76 strength now, so that's not bad. Just give me quick adamant, so I can be like... I don't mind going dry from Adamant to Rune. Just give me quick Adamant so I can then be excited when I get to Rune. You know what I mean? Come on. Adamant right here. This one's the one. Adamant. Come on. Right here. Andy. Bam. <gasps> yes. Okay. Okay. Nice. 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 Very nice. <laughs> and now all we need is Rune, man. All we need is Rune. Let's go. That was back to back again. Like, what? First I'm dry in between for like two hours and then I get back to back. Come on, give me back to back to back, rune one right here. Come on. It shows one here for me, Joselito. I don't know. There it is. Oh my god, yes. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go. Oh, finally. Okay, good, 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 good. The stats. And I'm not even 85 combat yet, so if I get like super lucky downstairs, it's gonna be great. But 84 combat, um, those are the stats. We're gonna. I'm gonna quickly show you in a moment, but firstly... I need to grab this. I'm gonna maintain that. That's fine. Um, ah, fuck. I forgot. God damn it. There we go. Beautiful. Basically, we're sorted out right now. Just gotta get... Uh, I'm gonna get 100 at a time for the last room. And we should be really, really good. This is really awesome. I'm happy. Raid 1 is fucked if you don't have it. Oh, yes! Woo! We got it, boys. Let's go. It is done. Thank fuck. I'm out of here. See you later. Nice. That's so good. Let's go straight to Slayer. But firstly, I actually want to get myself a looting bag. But look at this. This looks beautiful. 
Oh, that is so awesome. I'm so happy. Uh, those are the stats at the end of it. 65, almost 80, 60 defense, and 50 prayer. Almost 51, one bone away. That is awesome. Let's go on with Slayer. Okay, we're going to trade this in real quick. We're going to trade Mr. Emblem Trader, and we are going to buy ourselves a looting bag. Let's see if it works. It works. That is so good. That is so good. We are able to bank items. Well, we cannot withdraw them, but we can bank items in the looting bag in Deadman mode, which is huge. Like, it's really massive. This will mean that basically throughout any Slayer, uh, we're going to be able to just bank our loot, which is going to be awesome. So, yeah, let's get right to Slayer. I'm excited. That's awesome. All right, let's begin. What's the first task, Neve? We start off with Trolls. Yeah, quite out of everything, but we're gonna do the do it anyways. Should be all right. Let's go. And there it is, 81 strength already coming through. Combat level 86. I'm alone out here at trolls, so it's pretty nice. Have a hundred of them left on the task, and the slayer level right now is 44. So getting up there very quickly. I'm excited to see what the other tasks are gonna be, and I'm gonna update you guys on the every strength level. Mm, it's quite a little bit of time in between each other, but it should be still pretty fast because it's deadman mode. The first long bone of the tournament, that is pretty rare. I'll take it, put it straight into the looting bag. Um, let's see how many we get this tournament. I'll keep all of them in the bank. There we go, just got 82 strength. We are all the way up to 49 slayer right now, almost 50. And we have 69 trolls left on the task. Let's go. 83 strength coming in we're going hard 23 trolls left on the task so not that many i shouldn't be getting another level on this task um but yeah that's pretty awesome 83 already all right almost time for a new task uh we got all the way to 83 strength in the last one 54 slayer we get call fights nope not doing those uh let's skip with Tural. here we go neve round two give me something better call fights again bruh I'm actually unlucky. Well, I guess uh, we go and skip again. Feels bad, man. There it is. We're now at 84 strength. Uh, Slayer level currently 56 and 112 blood welds left to go. Uh, did, did, blah, blah, blah. This task should give me a lot of levels, so pretty excited to see where it gets me. Just got 85 strength. Missed it as usual, but we're still going hard. 69 once again blood welds till the next task. 58 Slayer already. Getting very close to that 60 and I'm looking to probably finish the day off close to or even over 90 strength today. So that's really exciting, which means 100% 99 tomorrow or even today. We'll see how much I play, um, but really excited to see where it takes me. Um, gonna keep slaying though. Gotta get that 85 as fast as possible. 86 strength already accomplished, 60 slayer and 370k away to 87. It's going really fast, especially because of this task. It's just the best task in the game for me right now. So that is awesome. All right, Neve, be gentle, please. We're almost 87 strength. And what do we get? Black demons. We're going to probably train attack on that task. Get it to like 70, 75. I will... Uh, should I do it, Chan? I might do it while editing, honestly. It's not a good task. Probably worth skipping. Probably worth skipping, actually. I might skip it. I'm not sure. All right. So, decided not to skip the task. These are the stats exactly 12 hours and 14 minutes after the release. Um, I got two nerd logs again. If you don't know what a nerd log is, it's when you're logged in for six hours and you get kicked off the game. So, had two of those already. And, uh, well, we're going to keep going. Uh, but these are the stats just to show what we have. I'm probably gonna go for 78 attack just so I can wield uh, Vesta's weapons and then we're gonna finish off 99 strength. Hopefully you guys enjoy day one. I'll be back with you day two and definitely check out my Twitch because I'll be streaming many many hours in the following week. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Hello hello beautiful people. Welcome to day two. It is very early in the morning so 5 30 a.m. I haven't slept yet actually so I'm not exactly sure how long I'll go before going to bed but we're starting the video off with 78 attack which is the attack required for 
wielding the Vesta's weaponry and 86 strength. We're gonna f push for 99 strength next, obviously, and then after that 99 attack, after that 99 defense, and we're currently 66 slayer, nearly done with my black demon tasks. So there we go, I filled you in on the basically day one, but if you want, make sure you check the day one first before this video because a lot of things happened then, and obviously if you missed it, you might as well watch it, right? So the plan for today is actually very simple, get as close to 85 Slayer as possible, so let's see how close we actually end up getting. I didn't even realize, but that prayer potion supply drop was 18 of them. That is freaking amazing. As you can see, my inventory is horrifically bad at the moment, simply because, well, I was editing the video, so I risked it. I took 20, like, I took my full inventory of prayer potions and uh, two super dose uh, potions with me. Um, so, yeah, I'm kind of risking it, but I have 15 left, and I'm not going to bang before I finish this. Hopefully, karma doesn't get me. What a sick task that one was. Got a lot of prayer potions. Got, look at this, man. Two rune chain bodies, two rune man helms. I'm stacked on cash right now. Also got 87 strength. Didn't record it. I was enjoying solo missions stream. And also got 67 slayer out of that beautiful, beautiful stuff. Uh, I'm quickly gonna buy uh, just two packs of water runes because uh, I will need them for Falador teleports. And yep, that is awesome. Let's see what the next task is going to be. All right, moment of truth. Please give me something nice. Black dragons, a oh, very quick task. I can just uh, go right to Falador, skip it basically super quickly, get some bones in the process, probably get close to 52, and then just go right back. So amazing task. New task. Fire giants, that's actually a very good task, nice. And look, peep my ear for a second here. We're literally balling, man. We have combat bracelet, full rune, everything. Strength amulet. We are ready to smurf. All right, just missed 88 strength. Probably gonna get 89 strength in this task. Maybe even close to 90. And got 68 slayer in the process as well. Getting that slayer level up very quickly, which is really, really nice. 89 strength, as said earlier, got it in the same task, 35 giants left, and we are 69 slayer, getting closer to 70, so definitely getting up there, almost at gargoyles, once we get to gargoyles, we start making very nice money of that task, so it's really, really exciting stuff ahead, I'm starting to have hard time speaking actually, so I think I'll be heading to bed very soon here, but 34 giants to go, let's do it. Alright, the moment of truth. Some blue dragons, we're gonna do them momentarily. But there we go, man, 90 strength already accomplished. Nine more levels for that beautiful cape, and it's going pretty fast, man. 95 blue dragons left to kill, already 70 slayer. We're getting up there. Let's keep going. All right, I need a good task because... Bro. Neve, be gentle, please. Give me something nice. That's alright, we can get tier 5 emblems from that, I'll take that. Alright, we just got ourselves 91 strength, uh, and oh shit, we just got a, got a supply drop. Basically back to back almost, which is pretty cool. Um, nonetheless, 100 hellhounds left to go, nearly 72 slayer, so we are almost at a point where we can kill wyverns. And now the levels will actually start taking quite a little bit of time to accomplish. Um, I also started to, well, I stopped flicking for this task, mainly because, well, I'm just getting a little bit tired, so we're just chilling, praying melee, doing it a little bit slower, wasting a little bit more money, but we're all right at the end of the day, so just gonna get that 99 eventually, and uh, yeah, let's see how long it takes, I guess. Oh, that is what we like to see on the floor, Mysterious Emblem Tier 5, the first one of the tournament. If you're unaware of what that is going to give us, this is probably gonna be a rune pouch, the first Tier 5. Is gonna be used on rune pouch, so we're gonna have two extra inventory spaces, and the uh, further ones are gonna be just used on potions or whatever. Uh, basically, a lot of money if I want to, I can buy, uh, I think, five D sims maybe. I don't know. Basically, it's very, very good rebuild. I might not even use it for the pouch straight up, um, but it is very, very helpful. I'm gonna pretend I'm not that tired right now, completely missed 92 strength, thanks to the stream, people reminded me, and I guess we're officially halfway done to 99, uh, we're also only 7 hellhounds left on the task, nearly 73 slayer, uh, we can now do wyverns if we want to, which is one of the best ways to get DFS, but that's not something we'll be going for. 
Um, so just gonna continue training strength as I said halfway done. Let's go. You guys don't want to know what just happened I nearly died actually on this account I was escaping on my alt account and someone saw it on stream that I wasn't paying attention and nearly killed me on this account even Okay Oh my god What the fuck? So luckily we made it out somehow and I was risking quite a lot of shit as well including the tier 5 here But at least we made it out. We're gonna grab a new task and then I'm gonna go to bed. I cannot play while So tired um, But it's okay. We survived. I guess we're lucky. Let's see what the next task is real quick though Holy fuck that could have actually been very very bad, but it's all right. We lucked out. We got mutated Zygomites and I cannot do them because I would have to go and get myself like Draymond staff and shit. So I'll have to skip this one. I think I'll just skip right now. And then uh, when I get a good task, I'm actually going to end it for today. All right, please, Neve, give me something nice. Bro, here we go again. I think that's third time in a row. What do we get this time? Beautiful task. Nice. That's so good. All right, I have finally decided to wake up. And please don't mind my fucked up voice. It's going to be like that for a couple of minutes, but... Either way, uh, I ended up getting, well, 55 a range for now. I'm gonna get myself an Avas Accumulator or a couple of Avas Accumulator and I will continue to train range until 70. So then I can use Black D Height set and that's gonna be very helpful against all the majors that are out there. Uh, people have barrages already, therefore we need to protect ourselves. And I'm also gonna get Agility up for uh, shortcuts. Uh, pretty fast right now. I'm gonna probably get one more range level here because I'm really close to 56 Then we're gonna get 31 agility for the next shortcut gonna get up as accumulators And then I'll turn the stream on and continue grinding slayer. So let's see how everything goes And here we go. We just reached 31 agility, which is the next small shortcut between uh, champions guild and uh, Drainer manner and that's gonna make it so I can get my Avas accumulator very very safely So let's go ahead get that. I'll get three of them. I don't think I'll be dying three times, but uh, for safety measure and uh, After that we go back to Slayer. It's gonna be exciting Here we go devices. We're gonna take Avas accumulator and we're gonna take three of them like so beautiful back to training First superior of the account. Let me get that heart real quick. Superior, no, they don't have more chance to spawn. Oh, look at these 30,000 experience, man. That's crazy. Blood rune, sea turtle, anglerfish, blood weld. It's beautiful, man. It is beautiful. Let's see how much of everything we got. Not too much, but that 30k XP is really, really helpful. Here we go, we are about to reach a very nice magic level, which is 55, that means we can now cost, uh, cast High Alchemy, which is also going to be a nice way to make some money. I have a lot of things in my bank that I can High Elk from Warrior's Guild, like all sorts of uh, Mithril stuff. Um, but for now, I have these Wrath Runes that each Elk for 300 each, so we're gonna be making some money doing that for now. And uh, obviously, the goal is to get as high heart up on magic as possible. It also gives you magic defense, therefore an easier way to escape a PKer. Um, and I have 80 blood welds left, so we're gonna be doing this for a while, or at least until I'm 70 range. Once again, for the dehyde protection against mages. Superior number two, I believe. Come on, one more hit. 29,000 XP for some Samphu serums. 12 of them, that's sick. Blood Weld Head, Spider's Eggs, we're gonna yoink all of it, it's not bad, it is not bad, hit away, and there it is, 70 range, which is beautiful, that means I can now wear a Black D height set, and we can also return back to melee training and speed everything up significantly, also, if I get task anywhere outside in the danger i'm also gonna get my agility up if it's somewhere in this cave i'm not gonna get my agility up because i don't have a need to but yeah that's pretty exciting not bad here it is man 75 slayer 
Gargoyles unlocked, one of the best money makers to rebuild if I ever die. Super exciting stuff right there. Um, and we're very close to 93 uh, strength as well. So hopefully we get those gargoyle tasks, make some bank, and I'm excited. Alright, let's see. If I get shit task here, I'm gonna do monkey madness too, and I'm gonna call Steve instead of Neve. Good, good, nice. And uh, I have a bit of an upgrade right now that just happened. So this is the deal I made with a friend of mine. Uh, so basically he gives me black mask very early on and I give him best in slot legs basically at the end of the tournament. And uh, this item means everything to this account. As Saddled would say it, um, it's gonna speed up Slayer significantly. And especially because we're gonna do a lot of Slayer, the black mask is just... It is just gonna help us out a lot. And we're very, very close to 93 strength as well. And we're probably getting very close to like a mil XP an hour right now. So we're looking at getting 99 strength in about 6 hours, I would assume. If we get good tasks, that is. And 93 strength was accomplished just a second ago as well. Which means that we are now officially over halfway um, to 99. So let's keep going. Hold up chat, I'll talk with you in a moment, I just need to get this level. There we go, 94 strength, we're like an hour away, a little bit less to 95. Uh, and we are 76 Slayer already, which is beautiful. <laughs> Wyrms, not again, dude. <laughs> not again, oh my god, I have to skip again, I'm not doing Wyrms. Boom, and Neve. Oh yes, Bloodveld, beautiful task. Nice, with a black mask as well, this is going to be amazing XP. There it is, 95. Four more levels to go, an hour away. Let's keep grinding. All right, can I get gargoyles? Cow fights? Fuck, I need to skip that as well. I'm not the luckiest with the, with the tasks. I'm gonna be completely honest, but it's fine. We're just going to quickly go ahead, get a new task, and we will be... We'll be... We'll blah, 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 blah. All right, please. That's all right, fire giants are good. We'll do them. Oh fuck, how do I miss that? Every single time I'm explaining something, I look away from the screen, I'm reading the chat, boom, miss the level. But 96 accomplished about an hour again, I guess, away from 97. We are almost there. Let's keep going. Give me good task. I hate you, Neve. I hate you with passion. Skip task. Neve, we're gonna have a talk if you give me a bad task here, man. Ah, uh, it's okay. I can do this very quickly. All right, please. Kurask. Ooh, we are gonna do this for sure. Because you get a lot of nads doing it. So this is an amazing task. I'm just not sure if I want to melee it or range it. Probably range it and alk at the same time. That is very, very good, actually. Okay, what we're gonna be doing here is we're going to be trading in our... Uh, our tier 5 uh, emblem. Wait, broad arrows. Right, right, right. I'm gonna have to buy broad arrows. I completely forgot about that. Um, but we're gonna quickly throw a mysterious emblem in here and we are going to buy ourselves a imbued scroll Magic shorebow imbued scroll and I actually just need broad arrows for this one So we're gonna put this on the bow bow is now useful and let's talk to a slayer master by broad bolts Because I almost fucked up because these are not good for kurasks And then we're gonna go and do the kurask task And it's gonna give us nice range XP Nice magic XP All in all, really good task Alright, so In the previous clip I was 43 agility Right now I'm 63 agility There is a good reason I decided to get this up I got it up by basically just doing agility rooftops But the reason being is This unlocks very important shortcuts uh, For my next plans on the account uh, You'll be seeing the next plans in my upcoming video And uh, but just to quickly summarize it, I want to get 71 agility. If you want to look it up, basically it's for shortcuts. And it gives me a lot of safety in certain areas that uh, I otherwise wouldn't have. So it's a very important skill for me to train. But unfortunately, it slows down my strength training. So I will not be reaching 99 strength today. But it is perfectly fine because the tournament is 7 days long. It is not a um, sprint, it's a marathon. So uh, we're going to be having all of that done tomorrow. 
Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to day three of the Deadman Mode tournament. If you missed day one and two, definitely check them out because they are pretty good episodes. And uh, these are the stats we're gonna start the episode off today. I spent a lot of time getting this 71 agility. Basically, this is a big, big thing for me because it unlocks so many escapes and a lot of people just don't bother training agility. So it is all in all a very useful thing to do. So I should get 71 in one or two laps right now. And then after that, we do have Kurask task. We're gonna be finishing 99 strength today probably start moving closer to 99 attack and closer to 99 defense and we're gonna see how much magic xp we get in the process as well so super excited for all of that however word on the street is that a lot of the quest areas are heavily camped right now so my plan was actually to train to do all the questing at this very moment however since that is not possible i'll just continue with my regular plan unfortunately though we are not going to have piety so and at least uh as of right now so it's gonna be a little bit annoying but we're gonna pull through it and let's just finish with the 71 agility. Bam, 71 agility out of the way. Beautiful stuff, let's kill some Kurasks. I will talk about the plans very, very briefly right now. So first things first, my defense is still 60. Gonna get that thing up to 70 very quickly, just so then when I do end up questing piety, I get that piety unlocked instantly. And that's gonna take just a couple of minutes of this task because this task with leaf bladed um, battle axe is actually amazing. Um, and then after that we're gonna go for 99 strength and then after that I might do like 75 defense and then 99 attack 99 defense Basically, that's the plan. Uh, let's see how far we can go. It is very risky here I'm risking my black mask. That's why I'm not streaming this task right now It's actually pretty dangerous if a big clan comes in and I'm not focused So I'm gonna stay focused for this one. It's a long task and uh, it should give me a lot of XP Yo, that thing is massive and I can't hit it. I hit like 10 zeros already there we go, 79 uh, Slayer at the kill, and I ended up not getting anything special. But that kill took a while, man, holy shit. Alright, let's keep going. We are 65 defense, 5 more levels. And there we go. 70 defense unlocked, now we just strength. Now we just train... Now we just train... Now we just train strength till 99. Oh shit, yo, okay, so there we go, 97 strength out of the way, which is beautiful, two more levels to go, about two hours left on that 99, um, what if we get a good task that is? so probably it's gonna be like two and a little bit, two hours and a little bit, um, but really good, and we made a ton of money, so let's just finish this 10 more, and then see exactly how much cash we made. Task is done and we made quite a little bit of money, most importantly we got a lot of nets, so basically got 400 nets of that task, 200k cash, a lot of alcaballs, I'll alk right now, another leaf bladed battle axe, I sold one to this guy, he still owes me like 70k, I don't know if I'm ever gonna see that money but either way we'll see. However, I'm gonna alk all the rest of the rune stuff and we made, look, if this was a normal account, 850k, that is really really good and very close to 80 slayer as well. That is beautiful, 183 gargoyles, it is going to be the task that's gonna make me a ton of money actually, so really excited to try it out, and I will probably do it with monks, therefore I will, um, well I'll just take a lot of prayer potions so I don't need to prayer flick. Nah man, that's, I just got a back to back, look I get one here, I got one kill in between, and here we have another tier 5, I guess the luck is on my side? Oh fuck, I didn't notice it again. Yo, 98 strength, one more level to go. And we have 99. What a task this one is. Look at this rune stuff and now look at all of that. 500k and basically just alks. That's gonna be amazing. This guy needs 2k. I'll give him 2k, no problem. And uh, yo, that's honestly really amazing. And I also wanna buy one rune pouch. And that's it. For now, that's fine, and there's a rebuild in there if I die at any point. And now, we're actually gonna go and train our prayer to 70, and then try to unlock piety. Hopefully, the quest areas will not be camped, but this is very, very nice. Alright, so, I'm gonna be a couple of bones short of 70, but thanks to Frenchie, we now have that almost out of the way. I'll just bury some bones while slaying, and we should be good and ready to go for 70. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, Shiloh is still camped. Uh, the word on the street was that Shiloh is still camped, unfortunately. And, uh, once again, thank you, Frenchie, for the help. I'm just gonna grab a task, and then we're gonna go questing straight up. I made sure to deposit, safety deposit, all of the risky stuff, but still, 
I will be risking a lot. Luckily, thanks to like gargs, like drops like these will be all right. But ah, oh, these nats and and it's not that much, which is nice. Uh, I don't actually lose that much on death, which is good. Uh, Abyss packs, we're gonna do them later. Um, I might though. I might take um, fire staff and just alk on the way. Not gonna lie. I'm gonna grab fire staff. Let's see. Number one completed. Uri obtaining Excalibur. Holy Grail is now done. There we go, new quest completed. We get a bit of crafting experience for that one. Not half bad at all. Beautiful. Let's uh, go and get our a little bit more crafting. I think I'll just spin a couple of flags. Okay, I have been scouted basically throughout the entirety of this quest. So we're not going to be completing Shiloh Village anytime soon, unfortunately. Even though I was hoping that I could, I can't. Um, at least that is now done. And the next one would be Shiloh Village that I now cannot complete, unfortunately. I am so fucking nervous. There's scouts literally everywhere. I don't want to go in here, man. How do I get the bone key back? Fuck me, dude. Okay. Ah, oh, that's lame. Good fine. Oh, that's so lame, dude. Alright, I gave them a little bit of money, unfortunately, but... I am so dumb. I lost my room pouch as well. I should have banked it. And I lost my black dehyde and... Oh, I'm too tired for this. I should have been to bed. Alright, whatever happens, we're gonna rebuild. <sighs> Very frustrating death, man. Gonna get another pouch. Kind of wasted one tier 5. And I had quite a lot of runes inside, which... It's just, uh, I'll blame it on me being tired, honestly. But I think I have enough points for another pouch. So we're just gonna continue slaying. Um, that's one thing I actually really dislike about Deadman mode. That the clans can control areas uh, that much. It is, I don't know, it feels unfair, not gonna lie. But, you know, it happens. It's a thing. It's in the game, so we have to deal with it. Uh, I also need to do magic shortbow scroll. Because I lost that, so... Uh, I hopefully didn't have Defender on me. I think I didn't, so it's all good. Um, burned out just a little after the death, so decided to get requirements for Desert Treasure. Here's 53 thieving. Still gotta get fire making out of the way, but I'm not gonna be doing that right now. I'm gonna return to Slayer or I will go to bed. I'm not quite sure yet. Okay, we got a big one. Alright, what do we get? What do we get? Crush next. Nice. All right, we just got ourselves a uh, Necreal. Nice, that's an emblem. I, uh, this is a very, very dangerous area though, so I'm gonna have to be careful. Um, because I will be taking damage here, but nonetheless I decided that I'll get 99 strength before I go to bed today, so that's what I'll do. And here we go, first 99 out of the way. Uh, we are gonna go and do attack next, and then probably defense last. And uh, this task actually freaking sucks uh, if you're milling it. That's why I would usually always range this task. But whatever, I just brew up and use a Sam few to heal. It's not that big of a deal. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be here for 93 more kills. Probably get a couple of attack levels. And then we're gonna hopefully get 85 Slayer fairly soon. What an amazing task. Made a ton of money again. Really nice rebuild here. We're gonna be able to alk a bunch of stuff. And we are also 81 attack. And once again, here's the emblem. So basically, that's for the loss of uh, Rune Pouch earlier. So we basically got it back right now, which is awesome. I really want to get an AFK task that I can just pay million and high alk at the same time. That's the plan right now. Hopefully, we get lucky. Let's see, what do we get? Calphites? Nope. But I think I have a skip. I have one skip. Turoth. Like, what the fuck are these tasks? I have to cancel that. That's really bad. Not a bad task, we got some fire giants, we're gonna do them, that's an alright task. 86 attack. And there it is, 83 slayer finally achieved, that means we now get to kill spiritual mages at some point if you want to. So we can get dragon boot upgrades, I'll probably go and do it at some point, I don't know how camp that's gonna be in the wildy. Um, but we'll see, I'll pick up a, a time and we're gonna try and give it a shot, but for now let's get two more slayer levels. Get grinding for those whips and keep getting those attack levels, 86 at the moment. Here we go, another superior. Can we get a heart? Can we get lucky? Let's see. And we get 
nothing. Alright, we need more Alks, and the way we get Alks is very simple. We trade the Emblem Trader and we buy a bunch of Rune Arrows, because why not? We have Emblems to spend and Rune Arrows to buy. They're gonna be used later with the MSB, and they're also decent to Alk, so as you can see on the top left corner of the Bounty Shop, the points are going down, and this is also going to be money, so it's not bad, it's like free Alks, kind of, not really, but it's better than free Alks, it's better than me Alking random junk, basically. Black Demons, and we have Agility, so very, it's really good task, actually. Mysterious Emblem, that's what we like to see on the floor, beautiful. Also, I ended up getting 89 attack, almost 90, probably getting 90 in this task, and we're super close to 84 Slayer. What's my rank in League? I'm a Master. Yo, there we go, 90 attack accomplished, really good, 9 more levels to go, super close to 84 Slayer, let's get it. 84 Slayer, one more to go for that whip hunt. Oh, if you're wondering where my whip is from, it's currently being lent to me by money. Uh, it helps a lot with this task and uh, yeah, it's just very, very good to do, to use. And uh, it definitely helps out with XP per hour we're getting, so thanks to money. Please, I just want to get some task streaks. I'm gonna fucking smash something every time I complete four tasks and then I get calfites. And then I have to skip it because... This fucking sucks. And then I can't get any points, so I will not be able to extend Krakens eventually. And it's everything's doomed, man. Everything's freaking doomed. Um, oh well, happens, I guess. Happens. Alright. Let's see. Is Niv gonna fuck us up again? No, thank you. Just got 91 attack, 8 more levels to go, we're getting basically a mil an hour in experience, so a bit over half an hour for 92. This task will get us very close to 85 Slayer as well. 92 attack, we keep, we keep going, 10 of these left on the task, 125k away from 85 Slayer. Alright, Niv, what is next? Gargs, alright, not bad, that's decent. Delete the vote. It's not that bad, man. It was a normal Slovenian conversation. Ooh, 85 Slayer coming through. Let's go. That is beautiful. Now we can do Abyssal Whips, but we have 22 Gargoyles left, so I'll finish the task, grab a new one, and see what we get. And I might continue just doing Slayer. I might not go straight for Whips, uh, just because I do want to get to 87 anyways, so I feel like I'll get Whip Task, I mean Abyssal Demon Tasks, in the process. Amazing task out of the way. Look at the money made. Oh, baby, those are gonna be some good alks. Alright, let's quickly check what the next task is gonna be. Black Demons? I'll do it. It's a really good task, actually. Very AFK. And we're also going to be um, editing the video during that task, I think. Alright, I will be ending the episode right here. As you can see, the stats on the screen are insane. One of the best accounts in the tournament, for sure. Um, however, I just got two rough tasks again, so I'll have to skip it. Either way, um, I really hope you guys did enjoy it. Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. If you missed the video of day one, two, and three, I highly recommend checking that before watching today's episode. But with that being said, I really do hope you guys enjoy. And before we jump into it, a massive thank you. We've been gaining just about a thousand subs a day. So very much appreciated and hopefully you will enjoy. Just ended up getting 70 prayer. Unfortunately, no piety unlocked yet for obvious reasons. Fools are still camping Shiloh village. Nonetheless, though, a big level out of the way. We now have four more attack levels to go for 99, which is my next goal. And then we just focus on defensive training. I'm not gonna bother burying more bones at the moment because there really is no ne reason to. I can just buy dragon bones of G if I want to. So I'm just gonna try to push through this task very quickly. About to get 86 Slayer as well. 86 Slayer and also just got 94 HP, so really good. Uh, one more level and we can get uh, Krakens, which is what I'm really going for. What is next? Drakes. Like. These tasks are so bad, man. I cannot go and do them. Bruh. Look at this dude. 
<laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> There we go, 96 attack, just doing my skip task of zombies at the moment, 3 more levels to go, about 3 hours if I get decent tasks, and uh, I can't wait to start training defense and actually beef up, uh, because after I get 99 uh, strength and attack, and after I do start training that defense, the PKers won't be able to kill me anymore, so I'm waiting for that moment, and I am very, very excited. Nice task, please. Let's go, what do we get? and black demons again i guess we're going back beautiful another emblem all right missed another level the usual but 97 attack was achieved about an hour and a little bit away from 98 and i can't wait to get that 99 out of the way iron dragons i fucking quit dude Ooh, blood welds. At least we get some blood welds, man. Nice. Boys, you know what that means, right? That is an insatiable blood weld. And that's a heart right there. Trust me. 29k XP, 87 Slayer and Super Combat Potions. Not bad. We can now get a signed Kraken, which is amazing because, well, we're gonna go for those Tridents. That's amazing. Reaching 87 Slayer in 3 days is not bad. There it is, man. 98 attack. Just one more level to go. And there's 95 hit points as well. Which is awesome. Let's get this final attack level and then start beefing the account up with some defense. I am excited. What do we get? This task most likely gonna get us to 99 attack. Neve. Beautiful. Would you look at that? That is an amazing task. Let's get a whip. That is a whip, ladies and gentlemen, and it looks beautiful as ever. Look at it. It's beautiful. Oi, let me pick it up, man. Thank you. Straight to the looting bag. That is awesome. If I get one more, I'm banking. But I don't feel the need to bank yet, because I kind of just came here. 10 kills for the first whip. Epic. All right, we have to go to the bank. We have to go to the bank. That's two whips. There is no point risking that much money, man. There is no point risking that much money. Two extra whips, man. Holy shit, let's go. Alright, so, um, something awkward happened. I got another whip, thought that I was recording, realized that I wasn't recording, uh, so I instantly tell it out. No point risking three whips, um, and we're gonna just throw them straight into the safety deposit box and go right back. Um, this is amazing. Look at this, two extra whips, this goes straight inside of here, oh, this looks beautiful, oh, oh baby, look at that, yo, that's hot, that's freaking hot, man, nice, alright, we're gonna go straight back, honestly, we're gonna go straight back, and keep going, maybe we get another one. The reason why it's a bit louder is because it is for calmers, oh my god, yo, another one. Holy fuck, three whips already, dude. Jeez. Alright, we lucky. We lucky out here. That's what we like to see. Almost 99 attack as well. And it can actually damage your wrist pretty badly if you have to consistently, consistently click. Oh my, that's no way, dude. Mother of Jesuses. I have gotten four whips in... <laughs> In, bro, in 70 kills, in 70 kills, we got four whips, four, one, two, three, four, let me repeat myself, four whips, ladies and gentlemen, four. Show your looting bag, dude. I need to go to the bank again, I have to, there's no other way. I have to, I'm not risking it, I'm not risking three whips on me, man. That's awkward. That really is a little bit awkward, I'm not gonna lie. Got him. Let's go. Holy fuck, yo. Oh, what?
what? That's my first time ever getting that. Oh, I have never had this in my life playing this game. I'm not even mad, bro. That looks sick. Bro, you can't be mad getting that, dude. Oh, do I look like a champion or what? It's worse than whip. But goddamn, it looks good, man. Holy fuck. That is so rare. 1 in 32k in normal game. It's 1 in 32k in here as well. The drop rate is not different in Deadman mode for the Abbey Dagger. That is 1 in 32,000, man. I've killed so many demons in my f life playing this game, but god, that felt good, man. I cannot be mad, dude. Wait, wait, one more spec, one more spec, watch this. Bam, and... Bam! Oh, that's pretty shit, but... <laughs> Alright, what's the new one? Uh, I wanna do it, but I cannot do it on stream, man. I'm gonna have to skip that one. I'm gonna have to skip that one. Let's sell one weep for basically just a little bit over a mil. I think it's alright. I'll do it because I know the name. And then I'll keep uh, this for the Barrows. I all right, I think I'm gonna go on a questing spree again. This is first quest, which is gonna help me when I'm completing dig side. It's a nice escape, especially with my stats. I should be able to fairly easily uh, tank till this place and then just um, just go down here and uh, basically escape. I didn't need to actually complete this quest. I just now realized I could have just placed a rope. Anyways, I ended up finishing the quest and we can now go down here. Um, we just pretty alright, right? Even if I'm scold, I can escape here for some reason. I don't know why I would be scold, but if I am, I can escape. Um, but yeah, uh, let's do dig side first. I don't know how many I'll do. I kind of want to do... Actually, you know what? I kind of want to do, like, more Slayer so I get my defense a bit more beefed up. So I think I'm gonna change my plan just a tiny bit, and we're gonna do uh, more Slayer first. Just a one or two tasks, just to get that defense up a tiny little bit. more. Okay, I'm gonna... Grab a new task right here, because I don't want to do the the bad one. And we got bats, which is fine. And at the same time, I'm also going to finish the quest, the troll stronghold, that I decided to do at the same time, basically. It's a very quick one, and it's a prerequisite for desert treasure. Um, and I'll see if I feel like going for more right now, or if I get more defense. Uh, but Dunstan, my boy, let me finish your quest, my dude. There we go. It is now completed. Uh, let's finish this task, see what the next one is, and then I'll... Uh, decide whether I want to do it or not. Alright, here we go. Arguably one of the most annoying quests to complete. Um, I usually just come here with 9 brews and don't really have a problem. Why didn't it work on the first time? Anyways, there we go. Dick side quest completed. A lot of mining experience. Got the 31 um, and all sorts of other things. We're gonna get a chocolate cake very quickly from Varrock as well. Uh, that's gonna be a nice one. And then we have a couple of easy ones to complete. And then we can start working on the desert treasure. I might complete all the pre-quests and then do desert treasure later. But I haven't seen a single scout yet. And the time is appropriate. So um, I might do the whole thing right now. We'll see. And here we go. That should be Temple of Ikov completed. Very, very nice. A little bit of experience here and there. And uh, now I have two annoying quests left to do. Um, and then we tackle on the desert treasure. Hello, hello, uh, gamers. We're out here. About to finish this one. I need five inventory spaces. I always get scammed by this place, man. There we go. Bam, done. I don't think I'll be needing these. I might still need those. I want to take my Samfu back up, my Shark back up. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Ready, ready, ready. Just finish them. Povej, just as a champ, make I think that I can see it, so it's cool. Here, man. Nima video, ne? Nice, 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 nice. It's so cool. Good shit. Nech, come on, fuck it, dude. I think that I can think. No, 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 no,
Jedna, dva, tri, nie. Jedna, dva, nie. Dej, dej. Nie. <laughs> dej, nie, kurva. Dej, 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 nie. <laughs> Prvoj som. Bo, 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 bo. Ja, to. All right, a tip for everyone. When you're doing this part of the quest, turn this shit off. That's first of all. Uh, where the heck is bat? Attack the bat with a very low combat spell. Because believe it or not, it will actually stack damage behind it. I've not done this cleanly at all, but it'll still do the trick as you will be able to see momentarily. So we're gonna come right here and believe it or not, damage will actually be stuck behind the bat. And all we're gonna do here is we're just gonna attack damage and that's it. And that should do it. Obviously I'm still prayer flicking, the problem becomes the second part of the damage. Uh, when he starts draining your prayer, however, obviously if you're using this trick, uh, he never gets to drain your prayer, so you use way less prayer potions, killing him. Okay, sick, and now you can actually just kill bat and spam click teleport, and it should work. There you go, perfect. Diamond number one. Here we go. Smash eyes. Nice, smash eyes. There we go, talk with them. Okay, we're safe. Nice diamond. Nice. Alright, another diamond, another guy killed. Did meet some Plerics, unfortunately. I was looking for him. He was nowhere to be seen. However, the final diamond is the easiest to get. And then we have all four and we go and finish the quest. Yo, mom, the diamond. Go! Just fucking go. Don't you... Stop, don't you stop, don't you stop, don't, don't, don't you stop. Don't you fucking. To, 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 please, 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 go through, go through, go through, go through. Nice, so. Berba. Boys, we actually did it. There it is, desert treasure completed. That's a huge relief. I was afraid that this was gonna be camped, man. I was stressing it out way more than I should. Um, but now this is out of the way and I am a happy, happy gamer, man. Um, that is super, super cool. Uh, we're now gonna get the staff as well for 80k and, uh, then we're gonna continue with Slayer. We're gonna edit the episodes and, uh, we're just gonna beef our account up. I'm so happy this is out of the way. I still need to complete Piety. Can't do it because of people camping quest locations, but at least this one's out of the way and me being comfortable in my skills, I can still potentially outplay people even without uh, piety so i do hope that they fix it on thursday and i might be able to complete it we'll see but i cannot do it beforehand uh, however really really happy with this quest completion all right here we go the last thing of this quest that i want to do as i said i want to get my staff uh, also people always wonder what i have been risking this whole time it's really not that much because snapdragons useless uh renards useless this is pretty wealthy. Snap dragon potions, useless. I have a lot of like rune arrows, a lot of like these and these and then blood runes. But honestly, if I die here, what I lose like potentially like 500k, 600k, something like that. It's really nothing too major and I banked my pouch obviously in case I were to die. So, uh, you know, went really smoothly. Now fingers are crossed that at some point I can complete piety, as I said earlier. And I might have to complete the crystal shield quest chain as well. And I still need to get magic cape too. Um, but uh, all at its own time. It's currently only Tuesday. Boys, it's only Tuesday. 11 a.m. And I basically almost have a maxed account. Like what more can you ask for? This is a perfect tournament for me right now. We're gonna grab the stuff for 80k here. And we're dipping. My man, goodbye.
88 Slayer coming through. We're killing freaking crawling hands. Please. What is this? I gotta skip again. Chasm Crawler. Uh, you don't get to see those very often. Um, let's hope for a heart, I guess. That would be pretty cool, right? Heart, heart is nice. Let's back him out real quick. What do we get? 6,000 XP and some bruise. Oh, I forgot my looting bag. I just now realized. Eh, not too bad. I'll actually do this, I think, fucking. I'm gonna cut out a couple of boring tasks here and there, but at the end of the day today, actually it's not even end of the day, but it's the end of the day for me because I'm planning to just chill right now and then go to bed because I want to fix my sleeping right now. I sleep deprived myself for those first couple of days, but now I want to get my life into a normal cycle again, sleeping normal hours, mainly because my account is basically very close to max actually it's not that far away obviously range will take a couple of days but because i'll do it the slow way i'll do it all in the wilderness hunting for those uh, pvp weapons and uh, i'll do like a lot of magic during like barrows and whatnot but nonetheless uh, the stats are really really nice at the end of today just got 83 uh, defense there as well so tomorrow definitely finishing 99 hp definitely finishing 99 uh, defense getting closer to like 90 ish range and close to 90 magic those are the goals i hopefully will be seeing you guys tomorrow thank you very much for insane support hey what is up beautiful people welcome back to day five of the deadman mode of progress now these are the stats before i start this video it's technically still day four but i have a scheduled upload for later today i'm gonna start this clip here and now i'm actually gonna go to bed and i will sleep for a very long time either way uh, the stats are on screen right now i have fire giants task so the plans are beef out the defense level to as fire har up as high far up as possible and uh, then start training range and magic um should be very simple honestly and uh yeah let's get some levels bro i'm going to bed hey there's a whip number five uh we're just chilling right now i'm not streaming um at the moment uh, i'm just uh, relaxing answering to some comments because my newest video just went up and that is always beautiful, just getting extra whips, that's about another 1.2 million to the bank. And we also are 89 defense already and very close to 97 HP, so definitely looking to max this out today. Um, Infinity Boots, Fury and Region Bracelet. Hey, there's 90 defense, that's sick. I just play both accounts. 91 defense, beautiful. 8 more levels to go, let's do it. Anyways. Bloodveld, nice task. This one could very well be the one, man. We've gotten a we've gotten a heart in the past. Twenty nine thousand experience for some food. All right, maybe this one is gonna, you know, stems and renards. Not too bad. There we go, that was a defense level, 92, getting closer and closer. 90 Slayer accomplished, not a single Kraken task yet, unfortunately. We're also getting super close to 93 defense, couple of minutes left from that, and uh, almost done with the task as well. So hopefully we get Kraken anytime soon, that would be great. Um, but yeah, let's see what we get. Kurask. Yo, that's dangerous though. Uh. That's pretty dangerous. I could just range it though. I think I'll just range that task. It's not too bad. Look at this big man. Get something good. I guess we're getting rune axe, dude. We can train wood cutting. Let's go, man. We out here. 87 magic. Beautiful. We got an emblem. Nice. Another one. It's always beautiful to get. All right. Let's see what's next. Ooh. Abyssal Demons, let's do them. Nice. Low amount of them though, only 129. There we go, 93 defense accomplished. Getting up there. Okay. I hate this video game. I keep getting drakes and I keep getting worms. I have one skip. I just don't... I want to get some points. Do you see what I'm talking about? Oh my god damn it, dude. 
Please, 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 please. Ma lei tu, no? Ma ce se ze bavăș? Ce e tăma? All right, please. Ugh, I'll do it. It's, uh, it's all right. Just very long. One more. Fuck. One more. And there it is. 88 Magician. Happening. It is happening. There it is, nearly missed it again, but not this time. 95, four more levels to go. Uh, yep. So apparently I just got 91 Slayer. Um, take a wild guess who wasn't paying attention. Hey, it was me. Okay, so 91 Slayer, that's pretty cool. A lot of XP away from 92, nearly 96 defense, almost 99 HP. We're definitely maxing like at least melee stats today. 96 just three more levels that's gonna be easy uh i kind of don't want to do this again the last time i got this i almost lost my shit because it was so long so even though i have to train range and mage i will actually skip this eh, not bad not bad first marble gargoyle boom what do we get what? Smack him! What? Die! What do we get? Nothing! And we're playing the game, every time Mika misses the level, you take a shot. I just got 97 defense and I missed the level, so... I think that's like the 10th th missed level of the episode. I'll take it though. Uh, we're two steps away from 99. What do we get? Ooh, really nice drop. Ref runes, blood runes, nice. I literally have the worst timings. I'm just enjoying my sandwich and I just got <laughs> 99 HP and I had no idea it was coming, um, but Yay, and just defense to go. Nice. Not bad, not bad. I hate this task with passion. It's the worst task. Stop giving it to me. It gives you every second time you get worms. Alright. Please. Oh. I give up. I give up 10 tasks in a row. Worms, drakes, worms, drakes, skull fights, worms, drakes, worms, drakes, skull fights. We're oh, aberrant spanks. Not the best, but I'll do them because they're AFK. They're chill. All right, what do we get? Black demons. Say no more. Let's do it. I missed 98 defense again, but one more level to go, and we have max melee. There we go. 92 slayer as well. As well, about to get another level here in a second. 90 magic as well. Uh, four more levels for that barrage. I can't wait to start training range with it as well. I will in a second. Let me get this 99 very quickly. One more hit and there it is. 99 attack, strength, defense, HP. Um, I'm gonna wait and the task is also completed which is really really nice. I can now focus on getting my range to 99 and get my magic to like I'm probably gonna get 94 in the process, and then we're just gonna finish off the magic on the Slayer task using magic darts and alking at the same time. But that is really awesome to see. The melee stats are now maxed, and we are uh, in on Wednesday 11 a.m. my time, so we maxed quickly. Um, but yeah, it's just gonna be like will the Slayer, will the PVMing right now, hoping for the PvP drops, and that's about it. So let's get 99 range next. I'm still gonna take a quick task just to see what I would get. Maybe we get like Krakens or something, still didn't get those. And we get Black Dragons, which I honestly can just do with range. So I will do that and then see what the next task is. Um, and yeah, just because it's a really quick task, no point of not doing it. Yeah, I think getting Mage to 99 first would be like sick. There we go, 82 range. I'm gonna smash this computer. Situation. Bloodveld, really great. Alright, let's do our strategy right now. 
We got 92 magic. We're still on the Bloodveil task. We're making 1.5 mil an hour. So uh, that means we are, uh, I think, four hours away from from 99 magic. So that's going to be my next goal. 93 magician. One more level to go for barrage. Um, we're like, what, half an hour away from 94. 39 blood belts to go. Pretty decent. This one's the one. No. How's it called? Hysteria, Tom. No, Ristilia. Where did I get? What? Tuna. I got Tuna. That's so bad. Okay, here we go. 94 Magician. Best spell in the game unlocked. I'm not stopping here, though. I'm going straight for 99. Um, and then the last thing that I'll train will be range. And we're going to do it all the way in the wilderness. Hoping for some PvP weapons. But that is definitely a huge, huge level to get. 95. There we go. <clears throat> the task is done. The magic level will be obtained. Fuck. One more, one more. There it is. 96 magic, three more levels to go. Let's quickly see what's the next one. Black demons. I can't really make... Okay. Uh, I guess I could mage that. I guess I will mage that. All right, well, that's the new task. And uh, yeah, that wasn't too bad, I think. That was all right. Um, so yeah, that was it. 97 magic, two more levels to go. 93 slayer, um, and we are getting closer and closer to 98 um, magic as well. So really grinding, and uh, I might be one of the first people to have all the stats, like all the combat stats, 99. Uh, but I want to end the day off with 99 magic, so I'll have 99 strength, uh, attack, defense, hit points, and magic by the end of Wednesday, which is really crazy to think about. There is nobody in the game right now that has these stats, so uh, I guess I am completing the goal I set myself on the day one to have basically the best account as fast as possible. Uh, so that's really, really amazing to see, man. I'm taking a new task because this staff basically only properly works on... Um, well, it only properly works on, um, well, tasks. And I guess I can do these kurasks. Um, yeah, sure, whatever. I'm also going to grab another Slayer's Enchantment and I need to buy more death runes. Here we go, 98 magic. Just one more level to go and I'm definitely finishing this today. And then I can take a very, very long and deserved sleep. The time is Wednesday, 7 p.m. GMT plus one, and we got ourselves 99 magic as well as long as well as 99 attack strength, defense, HP, and 93 Slayer. Definitely one of the few, if not the only, account in the tournament that has these stats. And I guess the last thing that has to be done is to buy ourselves the cape, uh, do the emote, and then just finish off with a 99 ranged. So let's go ahead, grab ourselves the cape. It's the coolest looking cape for the Deadman World tournament, in my opinion. And it is very useful as well. So uh, we're just going to go ahead and grab one. So obviously, I really do hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you did, a simple like and a subscription would be highly appreciated. We're gonna go just as hard tomorrow, uh, where we're gonna be going closer and closer to 99 range and hunting for some PvP weapons. And um, yeah, that's basically the goals for the next days, just get the 99 range as well. And uh, unfortunately, I might not be able to complete Piety because of the camping um, in the quest locations, but nonetheless, even without Piety, I reckon we could have a fairly decent shot. If we can make it to 1v1s, that is, obviously. Either way, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. As I said it many times, I'm very, very tired at this point. Been up for about 24 hours at this point, so I'll definitely have a long sleep now. And um, I guess I'm kind of getting closer to achieving the goal we set to the first episode, which was to have one of the best accounts as fast as possible, uh, which is super exciting. And I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow, and thank you for all the support, and have a beautiful day. 
Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome to day six of the Deadman Mode tournament. Um, this video is going to be very chill compared to others. I completed just about everything I wanted in uh, the last video. Um, and those are the stats at the very moment. So the only thing we still need is a 99 range, which will be accomplishable either today or tomorrow, depending on how hard I go. Uh, but before I actually start the video off, I would just like to say massive thank you for all the support, all the new subscribers, welcome everyone to the channel. Uh, it really does mean a lot when you get that much of a support on every single video, and that's why I go that hard on Deadman mode, because the support is always there. You guys motivate me. Anyways, um, the goal, very simple today, get 99 range and complete the series, complete the account, and then we kind of just need to wait for the final hour, there's not much more I need to do, I have the gear, I have the things, um, and yeah, we're just gonna see how it goes, but today, just chill and get some levels. There we go, that's 83 ranged, um, just gonna keep going. That is 84 range. Just got 85 range, we're going at the rate of about 600k XP an hour because I'm not prayer flicking, I'm just AFKing. Once I start prayer flicking, it's gonna be a little bit more, um, but just giving it a shot right now. I might just do this while I have these pots still, and then I think I might do Magic Cape 2 and then start the stream. Uh, we'll, think, we'll see how things go though, uh, the time is appropriate, so I, might, I should honestly do Magic Cape 2 today, and uh, I think I'll go for it. 86 range, not bad. Alright, we are about to do something very, very risky, but very important for the account. Um, and we're gonna be risking a lot of money in the process. A lot, a lot of money, but I'll sh I should be okay even if I die. Uh, but hopefully I'm not gonna die. I also will be scouting the areas, but it's still multi all the way through, so... The chances of dying are definitely there. Hmm. A bit unfortunate that he's also doing it at the same time, but I think I should be maybe all right. There we go. First part done. There we go. Oh fuck! Let's take a couple of extra of these. Okay, so this is Sarah, Gothics, Zami. Okay, no more cash needed. Now that I think of it, I could have easily get my 99 magic just doing this, but I guess it's still fine because I put it on my yesterday's video. So today we do this risky stuff and then we are basically ready for the final hour. All we then do is finish off 99 ranged. This this part of the tournament is always so stressful for me. It's currently 5 a.m. Stayed up all night. I mean, I uh, stayed, uh, slept all night to stay up very early in the morning to finish this. And I'm stressed out. <laughs> But I think we'll be okay. As you can see, my inventory is so bad right now, man. Maybe I should have just banked a couple of things, but I think it's gonna be alright. Yeah, I, I wanna do it all in one go without showing myself. I just hope I manage to do the actual thing very easily, without too many problems, without banking in between. Having to bank in between, it was just extend the chance for you to die. Alright, so here comes the very annoying part, uh, Magic Cape 2, that I decided to do very, very early in the moment, and I actually ran across some people from the same CC that I was in, so they actually just ended up going around with me, which was perfectly fine, it made me feel a little bit safer, because I'm always extremely stressed out during the Magic Cape 2, so just having a couple of people around uh, just felt a little bit easier, but as you can see, they <laughs> they were in freaking Zamorak robes, so if I got attacked, they wouldn't really be able to help me much, but nonetheless, they ended up watching the boss fights, and uh, it was pretty cool just chatting with them and be calm, um, basically, in the morning, and then, uh, yeah, just ended up finishing all the bosses and got myself a cape, which is the best cape that we can use for the final hour, and it was a very, very important thing to get. Alright, so that is now done. We have the best cape in the game, thanks to some OT boys. Um, they just strolled by, we had some fun, did a small drop party for the boys, and uh, yeah, we're just gonna go straight back to Ankus, get our range training going, turn the stream on, and have some fun. So awesome stuff, really happy, and now all of the like really, really dangerous stuff is out of the way. Um, and now it's just grind that range, maybe get a PvP weapon and 
that's gonna be it honestly um can't really be happier with how things went and yeah let's just get some range training going we risked quite a little bit of stuff wait that's busted dude i saw someone as uh, i the berserker here that i berserker ring that i have was also obtained from a thorak brother i think which is funny oh fuck yo 87 range not bad not bad good shit Good shit, we got a range level up. You have, uh, school was like 10 minutes away walk. It was great, man. Yo, 88 range, nice. Fuck! Uh, 89 range, yay! There we go, 90 range. Nine more to go. It's getting, s like, faster but slower, man. One hour per level. Not really, I'm getting 750k an hour, but... It's gonna take me a bit of time to get this 99 out of the way. But we're gonna stay strong, hopefully finish it all today, and uh, yeah, pretty exciting stuff ahead. 91, uh, we're currently 2.2 million XP in. No PvP weapons yet to see, but we're getting up there. A 92, halfway done till 99. There's like no one doing AFK stuff though, because people have no reason to play the game because you camp in like 3 minutes and then you don't have anything to do. So there's not really many people AFKing, man. There we go, 93 range coming in. I promised myself I'm gonna go to the bank after I get this level um, because I need to restock on my potions a little bit. So not too bad. Scary stuff. Oh my God, the looks some naked dubo. Oh, Kuslabu. Dosa, man, drop here in your PSD. Oh, Kuslabu, eh? Yup. Oh, well. But then got like, yikes. What is this? Uh, oh, I didn't skip that task. We smart, we smart, we still have smoke devils, okay, okay, we smart, yes, yes, we smart, okay, I'll do that like off stream though, I cannot do that on stream, we're just gonna go straight back to multi and, uh, straight back to wildy and get 99 range, we just got 95 range, I, uh, I was, uh, guess who, guess who wasn't ready again, uh, but no, on the real though, four more levels to go, couple of hours, boom, boom, left, right, we're gonna get that done in no time, it's gonna be awesome. In what clan are you? I'm in Mika DMM. We consist of a lot of top tier breeds in the game. We have um, we have my boy B2 Flex. He's like one of the best breeds on 07. He has like a level 70 combat account. It's pretty good. Um, then we have um, Neta. He's like he's like a skiller, dude. He specializes in skilling. He has like um, I think like 43 crafting, so he can make like. Hard leather body already, so... <laughs> Wait, why is solo mission here? I don't know, if they're gonna hit me, I'm gonna fight back. Oh, okay. Sure, let's go. Good luck, bro. Where the fuck did he go? Alright, goodbye. There we go, 96 range. Three more levels to go. About an hour and a little bit away from the next level. So I'm gonna assume about four hours away from 99 at this point. We've been going pretty hard, it would be nice to see more PvP weapons, aside from like, throwing axes. Uh, but I can't wait to be done with, uh, I can't wait to be done with uh, range. Thank you very much.
Hey, what is up, beautiful people? I just woke up after an amazing sleep uh, because, well, today I could take my time off and relax because look at the stats, we're basically almost done. I have to finish these two range levels, but then I still have a secret plan that I want to do and I will not be able to stream it. So we're going to be hunting for a cult and we're going to be hunting for eternal boots. Uh, I already have infinity boots and uh, a cult would just be really nice addition to the gear. Um, and we're just going to see what we can do and hopefully we get lucky obviously um, but those are the stats at the start of the video we are nearing 60,000 subs on uh, on YouTube which is awesome also if you missed the first five days definitely check them out there's gonna be playlist uh, in um, what's it called in a card top right corner uh, or you can just search for Mika day one and you're gonna find a video but let's jump right into the levels and finish off completing the maxed account Oh shit, I just got 98 range. I'm watching a stream right now. One more level to go. All right, change of plan right now. Uh, I'm gonna try something. I think it might not work the way I want it to, but I might finish 99 range on smoke devils. That's my task at the moment. Uh, we have the face mask, we have everything we need. It's a very long way to tank, so that's my inventory and it is in multi. Nobody in the bank. All right, we made it through. That's probably the hardest part where you will most likely get scouted. And now here's another part. If someone is already in the cave, they're most likely going to be scouting outside, which doesn't seem to be the case. So it's really good. Okay, that's a bad plan. I'll, ch I'll change it around. I might kill a little bit of a boss um, and I'll do it with melee. Here we go. Plan B. Okay, after killing a couple of bosses, I realized it's not really worth it to kill a boss. I just go through my bruise way too quickly. I'm gonna restock, kill the small ones. I'll still kill them with melee, because that way it's gonna be like much faster than with range. Um, but absolutely not going to... Um, well, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna kill the boss, it's not worth it. We got a 5 kills though, just for, just for the taste, but not gonna go for more than that. In any case, if you are wondering, the drop rate is 1 in 512, I think, from the small ones and 1 in 300 from the boss. So I'll easier, uh, it will be easier for me to complete the smalls and just do more tasks rather than uh, complete the big ones. Because, yeah, it's, it's just, just not, uh, not, 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 it's impossible, basically. Like, I could do it, but I think the best way to do it on Deadman mode would be to have someone consistently rebring you potions and food so you don't need to go to the bank while having a scout outside. I'm not really into that kind of stuff. I like to play the game alone. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to restock on the bruise right here and we're going to go in there again. Uh, but this time we're going to do it like that and we're just going to melee. And I'm also going to grab a dagger. Did yes, throw some specs in there. Um, actually... Nah, I prefer to have one extra food. And we're gonna see how it goes the second trip. Should be pretty nice. I definitely need the stamina. Forgot about that. And we should be good to go. <gasps> no way, no way, no, 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 Get out of here, get fucking out of here, no fucking way. Baby, we just got what we were here for. No fucking way. Oh, I actually have the chills, dude. Oh my Jesus Christ. No fucking way. That is massive. That is so huge. Yes. Okay, gonna get a little bit more arrows. I currently only have 600 and uh, I'm actually gonna start skipping tasks. Smoke devils are not a good task to do after we have an occult now. So I'm not gonna waste more time doing it. We're just gonna skip tasks and the next goal I wanna get is I wanna do Cerberus. Now Cerberus is sketchy. It's sketchy as hell, but we will do it and I think we're gonna make it awesome. Like we're gonna have awesome time doing it. I'm gonna do it with a statue of Warhammer and uh, we're gonna like prepare everything for it. And it's gonna be really good. So that should be enough arrows for the rest of the journey to 99, which is just about uh, 40 minutes away at this moment. And uh, yeah, I'm super excited to see uh, if I can skip my tasks all the way until I get uh, uh, Hellhounds. Probably gonna be some PKRs in Birthrope uh, these days. Oh, and now I get fucking Kraken. Yeah, I'm not gonna waste my time killing Kraken because I wanted to get this when I was like 
earlier when I wasn't 99 everything already, but doing it now would be useless because I don't need any more barrels pieces and yeah, just don't want to do it, honestly. Only thing I want to do is uh, Hellhounds right now. Nope. Oh! Yes! That was quick. I only did one skip and I have Hellhounds. Oh, this is going to be amazing to stream. I'm so excited. One more hit, I think. A couple of more hits. And that should be it right here after the next hit. There we go. The goal is completed. The account is finished. It is currently Friday, 9.36 a.m. for my time. And uh, the goal is completed. We set ourselves the goal on, uh, well, the start of the tournament to max out the account and we have accomplished it. Now, what I'm going to do after this is Cerberus, which is going to be insanely risky and very hard to do, but we're going to see how it goes. I reckon we can do all right. And uh, yeah, let's give it a shot. Let's hope for eternal boots. <gasps> oh! 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 <laughs> oh! <laughs> Man! <laughs> Man. <laughs> oh man. Yo fools, do you wanna do you want primordial boots for piety? Oh mate. Oh <laughs> Dude I I don't even have a use for this man. I don't even know I can I don't even think I can create the boots because you need root crafting. Boys, we're gonna trade room crafting for the rest of the tournament. Oh my Jesus Christ. 60 room crafting stream. Oh man. Holy shit. <laughs> no, bro. Oh. Reckon I can do one more kill here. <gasps> Bro, Pagate, no, that's the wrong one. Oh my fucking god, 24k mate. <laughs> oh no. Why? What? Two two crystals in 24k mate. Oh. <laughs> Bro. What? <laughs> Dude, I can't be serious, man. I cannot be serious. Who has ranger boots, boys? Who has ranger boots? I know that someone has ranger boots because they were... Dude, this is this luck is unbelievable, man. I, ca I can't. Dude, you cannot stop that. Can we buy it? Justin... I don't know, man. I wanna ha... Can I... Do you have ranger boots, Justin? <laughs> this is wild, dude. Oh, bro. I was reading the chat. <laughs> I was reading the chat. It doesn't count. Mm -mm. Hopefully things are still on the floor, right? Okay, yeah, easy money. Whew! I wasn't sure if that's actually a thing. Oh! Nah, bro! <laughs> no way, man! Three crystal, two primordial crystals in 59kc, man. No way! <laughs> that is like, that is together, that's like 63 mil main game. 
you cannot write this. You cannot make this up. That is an unbelievable luck, dude. That is unfucking believable, man. Bro, what? Yo, I, that's a Twitter picture right there, man. Hold up, I need, I need to, dude. I need to make a Twitter picture with that one. Hold up, and then move this here as well. Holy fucking shit, dude. I have to make it, man. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> if you are not on the stream, you are missing out. Trust me. Holy fucking shit, dude. Oh, man. Look at this beautiful man in his bot outfit that we're trusting with 32 million, man. 32 mil. Watch him log out. Let's see how he can... I hate you, <laughs> fucking cunt, dude. <laughs> oh, mate. See ya! <laughs> nah, he, do he wouldn't do something like that. I know him in real life, I'll fuck him up. Come on, it's not funny, dude. I'll fuck you up, mate. <laughs> oh, it's not funny, dude. <laughs> God damn it, dude. This man thinks he's funny. This is... Dude, come back. Now I literally needed to make three clips because he was logged out for five minutes. Come on, make him. There it is. Look at this infusion, baby. Holy fuck, that looks beautiful. Now we need to get another pair of D-boots so he can infuse more. It's beautiful. He's <laughs> just walking away, man. Doesn't give a fuck. Shoku, this clip is taking five minutes, man. <laughs> Fuck's sake, dude. <laughs> Bruv. Give me. Look <laughs> at this fuck here, man. <laughs> Dude. Give me back my boots, man. I don't need your fucking rules. God damn it, did this, man. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I wanna go kill more Cerberus, man. Thanks. Holy shit, dude. Oh my, look at this man. Whew, beautiful. Alright, let's check the stats on this. Uh, dude, this is the longest clip of my fucking life, man. Yo, Shoko, appreciate it, man. Thank you very much, dude. Alright, let's uh, let's check the upgraded version real quick. Throw the Jordans on. What do we get? Bam, look at this. Plus 5 melee strength, better defense. They look hot as fuck. Hey, look at them, man. Whoo! Beautiful. Nice. Spend the whole fucking day for this shit, dude. Alright. Let me just log out here so I don't fucking die. Come on, seven more, boys. Seven more. Fine, let me just quickly log out. Oh! No, we missed it! But holy fuck, yes! Let's go! 60,000 subscribers. I am happy. I am happy. Thank you very much, guys. That is unbelievable. We started the tournament with like 54,000 subs. And uh, that is pretty good, man. I'm happy. That is pretty freaking good. No, 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 no. Do not unsub. Stay subscribed, man. Stop. Don't troll me. All right. Everyone unsubbed, man. Fuck. Come back, guys. Please. No, man, everyone has subbed. Wait, we're going back, we're going back. Come on. Now we need the exact number. Come on. This is the last chance. The last chance. <laughs> yes, yes, one more. One more. <laughs> one more, man. I need some drink, but I can't breathe. Hey, we did it! Yes, boys! That's a screenshot right here. A beautiful... Fuck, I need to do it nicely. I have it on recorder anyways, so it's fine. Bam! What? Kurva! <laughs> Oi! Come, come back! Come on, let's finish it strong, man. 
what a day it has been and wait this is actually gonna be a virtual level 103 strength right there on the kill for a rune to hander holy fucking shit boys that was a mad day 19 million strength experience by far rank one in strength 21 almost mil hit points experience three crystals obtained a cold necklace obtained Today has been probably one of the sickest days of Deadman mode I have ever had. I'm hyped and this is freaking awesome, Dean. And with all that out of the way, I now will conclude the episode for today. Now, first of all, a massive thank you guys for 60,000 subscribers. One step closer to my childhood goal of 100,000. Uh, and I believe one day we're gonna, we're gonna get there, man. We're gonna keep trying and we're gonna get there. And I just want to say thank you for a massive support on the video. We also made it to trending for the first time ever in my life with a RuneScape video for some reason. So I think we were trend trending in like Lithuania or some shit like that. So it's just, it's just uh, wild. And that's my... I have to go. Fuck. Um, but yeah, had visitors. Just want to say thank you once again. And uh, I'm going to conclude the video here. I'm unbelievably tired. But very excited with how the tournament went. And even if in the end we don't win, which will most likely be the case, since we do have all that gear, we do have that sick of an account, a lot of people will try to use Friend Finder to snipe us in the multi-area, which is perfectly fine. I played for the week, I showed you guys how I max, and I had a ton of fun doing it, and you guys enjoyed it as well, that's what matters. And in the next Dead Man Mode season, we're gonna go just as hard. And I'm also going to make a Deadman Mode 13 movie, which is going to be a longer episode showcasing all the highlights from this tournament. So look forward for that, probably either tomorrow, most likely tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited to see what the future holds, and thank you for all the support, boys. And the tournament ended with me uh, being completely out of supplies, uh, did my best, ended up being on approximately place number 330, 320, uh, out of supplies, out of everything, did everything I could, but obviously we played Deadman mode for the entire week, not so much for the very end, because obviously the way the tournaments are ran is just... Uh, it's really hard to get to 1v1s, but if you make it to 1v1s, you can go very far if you have an account that I do, and I think my skill set is decent as well. But anyways, that was the Deadman Mode movie. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope I'll see you all again here in two days with the last Deadman Mode tournament. Thank you for watching. You guys are awesome, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.